some of the reasons why I didn't overly enjoy this book was that um, I, I'm not the biggest fan of mystery books. I don't know. It's just, I don't find them that interesting. Just doesn't really intrigue me that much. Another reason why I didn't think it was that good of a book was because um, it was dragged on a lot. My biggest pet peeve of this book, by far, were the characters. The characters just, they were kind of bland and stuff like, like I could make up the characters, you know what I mean? They weren't very like, you know, like different. They were just like basic. So this book is mainly based in, in the Antarctica. There's like around a few characters. A few, my favorite one was probably the this younger girl. She was like 12-ish, I think. She was very cheerful, even though her father died a few months prior to this story. He just really likes like horror movies and stuff like that. There's this other character, um, he's a boy. He's very quiet, mainly because of his father passing. And he's just not really into much, he just really likes. So the mystery starts around chapter five-ish, I would say. Billy and her billy and vanessa go missing right so the two kids of the mom get really worked up saying or are they and they're just going crazy and they figure out as the book goes on that like like literally like hints so it's like their backpack gone I've seen their backpack and stuff like that and i'm not gonna spoil it how they find them or if they do find them yeah, so that's what the real mystery is, and obviously the mom being really concerned, just goes crazy. But overall, my review of this book would be like, 1 out of 10, 6.1, not the best in my opinion. But it was whatever, I wouldn't read it again, I wouldn't, I wouldn't want you to read it, but you can if you want. And yeah, bye.